So the tennis ball uh, rhomboid massage. A uh, bit of an awkward one to film because I'm against the wall, but essentially we have a tennis ball. This is a hockey ball, uh, just fine through a jumper. A hockey ball is a little bit firmer. Um, I've done this quite a lot already, so my shoulders are a little bit desensitized to it. Um, but, but for yourself, tennis ball that be, will be absolutely fine for now. Uh, yep, so tennis ball, um, kind of just drop it between your shoulder blades and the wall, and then as you come forward, it will sink down a little bit. Um, so find a nice tender spot uh, between your shoulder blades and your spine, so there's a, a nice uh, band of muscle, uh, your rhomboids and traps in particular. Um, and then all you want to do is yeah, find that tender spot and then just, just stay there for, for a, sort of 20 seconds until the pain significantly reduces. Um, so if you lean towards the wall more, obviously the pain will go up. Um, uh, just to a comfortable level, maybe a, a 7 out of 10. Uh, would be absolutely fine. Um, hold that position until it drops to about a three or a four. Uh, you can either stay there until the pain drops or as it drops to, to maybe a five, then you can reach towards the wall in front of you. So I'm reaching towards you. Um, just pushes your shoulder, uh, so it stretches the, the rhomboid, the muscle that you're pinching, and then relax. So important not to, not to contract, so to pull your shoulder towards the wall, you just want to relax it. So you stretch and then relax. Stretch and relax. And you can repeat that for, uh, for however many, sort of five to six areas around the shoulder blade would be, would be sufficient for now.